Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Michaela, and I make adult coloring, reading, lifestyle, vlog videos here on this channel. I really need to think of a new intro because every time I film like a coloring video, all I'll say is like, I make adult coloring videos, but then if I do literally anything else, I'm like, crap, I don't know what I am anymore. Um, I make everything here on this channel, and today I actually have my second and last Owl Crate unboxing. Let me explain really quickly before I get into the video. Um, I got Owl Crate for the first time last month in March, um, and I liked the stuff. I decided to give it another month, and last night I decided to cancel Owl Crate because I decided to instead subscribe to a slightly cheaper romance box, and um, I think I'm gonna like it more because I, the more I've been reading, the more I realize what I'm kind of into and what I'm not, um, and I really enjoy reading romance. So I got the Romance Reveal box, um, and I did the two books um, a month version for now. Um, so you guys will see some unboxing videos of those. There probably will be one this month of that. Um, it didn't really occur to me that like I'm gonna get one this month. So you guys will probably see that here in a couple weeks. Um, but yeah, that's that's kind of that. I decided to cancel Owl Crate. Nothing bad against Owl Crate. I think it's nice. I just don't think it's for me and that's okay. I gave it a couple months as a try. Um, and yeah, so this is my second and last unboxing video of my Owl Crate. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe down below for some more book content, some more coloring content, just all the content, feel free to subscribe, and let's get right into the unboxing. I also just want to apologize because I kind of look like an egghead today, like my hair is not cute, like I'm not wearing any makeup, it's just a very chill Saturday, you guys. This caught me on a day where I wasn't looking productive because I wasn't at work all day, so I'm just looking like this. But um, I was actually smart this time around and actually cut, um, wow, yeah, I'm covering it up. I actually cut like the bottom part off so I can open the box. Um, awesome, okay. Here we have the box a little bit, a little hard to do this, um, but I'm gonna set it down here and I'm just gonna dig right in. So first thing of course we have here is just the card and this um, month's theme is peek behind the curtain. Okay, so I, I'm looking at the card. I don't even really care at this point. Okay, this is the card. Um, and then the first thing here on top is this, ooh, it's a coffee, it's coffee. I remember them kind of spoil putting spoilers up on their Instagram, and I remember this being a part of it. Ooh, it smells good. It's a little bit dirty. I kind of wonder if it kind of leaked out a little bit. I'm not too sure. This is um, chocolate eclair, medium roast coffee. Wow, I don't have a coffee pot, or like a coffee maker. Um, I might bring this over to my parents and make it there. Um, I know you can also get like reusable K-cups that you can put ground coffee in. Maybe I'll do something like that. One thing with those that I've learned, um, my parents have some, is that the grounds kind of seep into your coffee and that's not good. Um, oh, but this is so cute. I love it. And I'm just gonna take a look at the card here. It's the Phantom of the Opera inspired coffee. So that's really, really neat. Um, that's a really fun addition. This box is not bad in any way, shape, or form. I really do um, recommend it if you're into this kind of stuff. Um, I just have learned that, you know, that maybe I'm not as much as I thought. So anyways, moving on into the next thing. Um, I'll do this thing next. Ooh, okay, we have a limited edition, limited edition enamel pin. It's in this little packaging right here. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead, open this up. Ooh, that's gorgeous. It's inspired by the Night Circus. That is a book I've never read, but it's really cute. Hopefully it's not really focusing. There we go. Very, very cute. Ooh. Okay, very fun. I, I feel like one comes every month and I don't think I got one last month. 
which it doesn't really matter it's fine I just I don't think I got one last night or last night last box so weird but okay so we have the pin very very fun and then I'm just gonna go into this box um it's just this black and gold box and it says for finding dreams that don't exist yet so it looks like I'm gonna just take a look at my little sheet here before I say something that might not be accurate I'm having trouble figuring out what this is I'm having a little bit of trouble figuring out what this is okay I might be able to figure it out at the end I don't know why brain brain is not working but okay it came in this box right and it had these two candlestick looking objects but I don't think that's what it is um okay and then there's this little um stampy thing and I'm not too certain what this is exactly am I I'm gonna have to you guys are probably laughing at me right now if you guys have any idea what this is you guys are probably laughing at me wow okay I'm just gonna pretend that didn't come in the box quite yet well maybe we'll come back to it but cute regardless I just gotta figure out what it is um and then okay I'm gonna skip this for now we're gonna move into this thing first um we have this thing which popcorn holder it's a popcorn holder yeah okay I guess it's a popcorn holder this is uh, what this little card was so I guess this is just like a little I guess it's a popcorn holder yeah um the conquering circus presents where the stage tells story spectacular and legends are born okay very nice a little popcorn holder <laughs> my brain is having trouble wrapping my head around what that was um okay and then we have this box right here um and it's telling me that it's gonna be a clock which I did see on the spoiler sheet so let's open this up let's see what this clock is about oh oh stop this is super cute Ooh. okay this is a really cute piece of decor maybe this will go up in my living room I don't know very fun though Ooh. okay I like it that's cute I like it <laughs> my brain is still having trouble figuring out what that other thing is I'm gonna look at this thing one more time oh I completely okay okay I completely skipped over the first thing on this list transform all of your written correspondences into special deliveries with this once upon a broken heart inspired wax seal kit designed by at paperback bones and lady chub letters okay it is a um a wax seal kit so like you know how you like stamp I think that's what it is okay and this must be the wax for it interesting interesting okay now that I understand what that is now perfect glad I got that out of the way uh next thing in the box is a mouse pad which is so freaking fun I might actually bring this to work because I don't love the mouse pad I have right now or maybe I'll just use it here since I have a desktop with a mouse we'll see um it says outside things may be tragic but in here we feel it's magic what is this inspired by let's see Moulin Rouge Moulin Rouge very fun that's cute I like it and then we move on into the last item in the box which is of course the book and I was um I follow I think Owl Crate like pops up on my Facebook it's like kind of usually sponsored um but I saw that people were like speculating what the book would be and this was kind of like the top speculation and it is Hotel Magnif Mag Magnifique oh god English English Michaela Hotel Magnifique mm -mm, mm -mm. this this book right here and it is by Emily J Taylor okay let's go ahead and open this bad boy right up and see what this book is about um I've heard some people talk about this book but not a ton so okay 
got that off and of course it is the signed owl crate edition and as always um there is a little like plate with a little note from the author which is nice and this book is of course ooh, oh this is gorgeous is also of course signed by the author as well which is always a nice thing to add to the collection um oh, ooh, hold on i'm gonna take off the dust jacket really quickly to show you guys the this part of the book really really stunning you know I really thought that they were gonna have edges of the book like colored but it's not um I don't know I guess I don't know but the inside of the dust jacket is also insanely gorgeous um this is the inside of the dust jacket look how absolutely stunning that is gorgeous um okay I'll just read it off the cover here like the little description of the book barely scraping by with a job at a tannery she's resigned to a dreary life in the in the port town of dirk caring for her younger sister zoza that is until the legendary hotel magnific Mag magnif <laughs> it's gonna pop up way too much hotel m <laughs> appears in town hotel m is famous for its astonishing enchantments especially its ability to travel the world arriving at new dest at a new destination each each midnight, Janny and Zoza seize their chance to join the hotel staff, and they're soon swept up in a world of sparkling chandeliers and impossible magic. But it's not long before Janny discovers that beneath its marvelous glamour, the hotel is hiding dangerous secrets. With the vexingly handsome doorman, Belle, as her only ally, Janny, Janny embarks on a mission to unravel the mystery of the magic at the heart of the hotel and free Zoza the, uh, and the other staff from the cruelty of the ruthless Matir... De hotel to succeed she'll have to risk everything she loves but failure would mean a fate far worse than never returning home seems intriguing enough um but yeah that is everything i guess except for um there's a couple little things i guess in here still that i didn't even notice right away um just next week's next week you guys what is up with me today next month's um sneak peek theme and as well as just the little pamphlet from this month that is basically it for this unboxing video like i said this is the end of an owl crit era it was only two months but still um but see here in a little bit i will do a reveal romance unboxing which i'm actually really really excited about i definitely think those will be books that like i'll want to read like right away i am a i'm a hoe for romance so anyways yes thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing video today if you enjoyed it make sure to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button down below if you're not already and i will catch you guys in my next video bye guys